Hey, this is Daniel Garofali on the red carpet of the Anfar Inspiration Gallery in New York City. Let's take a look. Hi, Bernie. Yeah. I love you. <laughs> um, hey, oh. I'm amazing. Um, how are you? I'm good. It's a pleasure to meet you. Congratulations on everything. Orange's new black premiering and the Time magazine issue. How do you feel? I feel overwhelmed. Honestly, I sort of feel like this is happening to someone else. I, every time I see the Time magazine cover, I'm thinking that like, you know, someone has sort of superimposed my photo onto Time magazine that it's not really real. But uh, apparently it is. So you're in the show tonight? Yes, I am. What number is this? You've done it a few times, right? I don't know. I lost count, man. I mean, the amount of shows I've been in, I, I don't even count anymore. Yeah, just yeah. You, Now you start to do more for more charity shows than you start to do shows for pay. How'd the rehearsals go? Uh, you know what? I actually need to get back there to do the rehearsal. <laughs> I haven't done it yet. So what's the, um, the driving force in coming back every year to support AMFA and being in the show? And um, just uh, losing friends and relatives to the disease and, and knowing that, you know, I don't put a name on it. I, we know what it is and we know that um, it's time to keep doing this so we can find a, a cure, you know, and we're getting close, you know. Well, as a Miss Universe, my main cause is working with the HIV Awareness Program, and Amphara is doing such a great job trying to find the cure for HIV. Somebody read my cousin's name, and, you know, and she was a nurse, and she got pricked by a needle, so it was just like, you know, it just, you never know how it's going to happen for you. We'll be supporting Amphara for a few years now, so when they called, they asked if they wanted to be part of it. You know, in a heartbeat, absolutely, it's such a good cause, and they do such a great job. So we're just happy to be able to support it. What's the driving force in keeping you coming back and supporting the cause? I mean, the, one of the most important causes that I can think about. I mean, this is AIDS is still like there, and it, there's a lot of people that get affected every year. So it's important to remind people this, but also to support the cure and I want to believe that we're very close to it. You know, it's a cause that's very dear because we have lost so many friends mm -hmm. you know, um, uh, through AIDS. So it's very close. So it, the effort is very little. We make very little effort you know, because it's really dear to our hearts. I've been uh, awarded myself by Amfar. Mm -hmm. So I'm just committed with everything that's AIDS, honestly. Yeah. The one who's really inspiring you to watch is Dr. You know, Mathieu de Cream, who really started Amfar, you know, awesome. led this organization early on and she was this beam of light. Do you know, I think that all of us, we are in a way mm, part of uh, this society and we really have uh, to be responsible, not because we have everything just to be happy, that's it. I've spoken to some kids at Hedrick Martin before and the kids are amazing. I want to go back there. They're so amazing. So awesome. I mean, I get, um, I get letters from Kim LGBT. I got a letter from a 12-year-old um, boy who likes to dress um, in girls' clothes um, just last night and, and he's, his mom knew that he was writing uh, me a letter and he wants me to come to this camp that he goes to and I'm going to try to go but it, it but I just, just brought me to tears to knowing because he his mom showed him the cover of Time magazine and he said that he was really inspired by me and that's crazy I just think about if I, when I was 12 if I had someone to look to on Time magazine who was a little bit like me my life would have been a little different maybe it so. made all the difference I bet which is what you're doing for young kids today which is just amazing and why do you think fashion and charity is such a good match because fashion is very media, it's very easy, everybody could understand when you talk about fashion mm -hmm. and uh, so it's very easy to approach people through fashion. On a lighter note, how does it feel to teach all of America about the female anatomy on uh, our interest in you? The show! Of course everyone's watching the show, what do you mean? I love it, when I read that in the script I died laughing and it was the first time I've ever shot anything where I wasn't sure I'd be able to get through it because it was so funny. I loved it. And like, and Laverne doesn't ever really talk about that stuff, but I love that Sophia does. Um, and I think it's important for us to know our bodies.